In an episode of CNBC's Beyond the Valley podcast published last Friday, cryptocurrency was referred to as dangerous and compared to gambling by Tim Berners-Lee, the inventor of the World Wide Web. During the discussion on the future of the Internet, Berners-Lee likened digital currencies to the dot-com bubble, where Internet stocks were inflated despite a lack of a solid business foundation. It is only speculative, and obviously, that is exceedingly risky, stated Berners-Lee in the interview. He added that investing in speculative ventures is not how he chooses to spend his time, likening it to a form of gambling. Hello. My name is Anna. Please stay with me. Today we discuss Tim Berners-Lee, the inventor of the World Wide Web, called cryptocurrency dangerous and likened it to gambling. While being credited with inventing the World Wide Web in 1989, Berners-Lee has expressed dissatisfaction with the way his original vision for the Internet has played out. He is now seeking to reshape the Internet's future through his startup in Rupt, alongside John Bruce. Their objective is to give individuals more control over their data. Both were interviewed by CNBC's Beyond the Valley on a variety of subjects related to the Internet's future. The future of the Internet has been discussed in terms of Web3 by many proponents. This catch-all phrase has no clear definition, but its advocates often claim that it is built on blockchain technology that was initially used by the cryptocurrency Bitcoin. Web3, they argue, is a decentralized version of the Internet that reduces the power of major players like Facebook and Google. However, in a recent interview with CNBC's Beyond the Valley, Tim Berners-Lee, the inventor of the World Wide Web, distinguished his proposed solution for revamping the Internet, Web 3.0, from Web 3. Berners-Lee said that Web 3.0 is not blockchain-based because the technology is neither secure nor speedy enough. Thank you for today. Hope you enjoy it.